Hey guys, Simone in here, and today we actually just found a Geiger counter that we just killed from a zombie. Now I'm doing a voiceover with this because the my my editing not my editing software, but my recording software has decided to unalive itself. So like the original microphone recording sounds choppy as frick. So now I'm doing a voiceover of that. Anyway, just throwing out some cobble over our inventory right now. So basically I was mining in this mine chef right here. And I killed one of the zombies and they dropped their Geiger counter. So now we actually have uh, something to see how much radiation we're getting. Which is very good. I'm going to walk over here and grab this redstone real quick. Now, actually watching your own videos is actually quite kind of interesting. So you talk too much about the same thing. Anyway, so basically I'm explaining, uh, basically, uh, the Geiger counter, like, you click on it and it tells you how much radiation you have and stuff. Alright, we're gonna go over here and, uh, fill up this water here. So I can actually, like, grab this. Oh, I ain't gonna grab anything. <laughs> Silly me. There is an there isn't any gold in here. That's honestly what I'm looking for right now, and it's not there. So, yeah, I hope I hope this is actually recording it properly. If it's not, I I will, I will actually go out the window. I got the first part of it over already. We're just in for the long haul now. We got so much stuff in our inventory. I honestly should just throw like half that stuff out. <laughs> yeah, so basically our idea is we're going to make a big reactor of like all the uranium and stuff that we find. That's why I need so much gold in the first place is to make that big reactor. Now this is obviously going to be a two part because I do not have a, uh, enough resources to make a big reactor in the first part. But I do have most of the resources, if that makes sense. <laughs> All right, I'm going to mine some more of this lovely rock here, and we're going to see if there's any other like places that could have any gold. Found some more azimuthium. Found some thorium, too. Very nice. I've never had to voice over for my own videos. Ooh, ouch. That had to hurt. So this is probably not going to be synced up properly because I'm literally just like... It's just going to be like a voiceover, obviously. <laughs> and I've lost my... I have lost the way. And how I've magically teleported to the surface. Actually, I just, like, chopped that part out, so that's why I'm at the surface now. I don't really actually edit very much, like, in post-production. Like, in my recording software, there's actually a button I can hit that, like, pauses the recording, and then I hit the button again whenever I get to, like, another area. Because if I didn't do that, then it'd probably take a lot more time to edit, and it'd pr take a long more time to, like, if I didn't edit it, the videos would probably be like half an like they'd probably be like an hour long. So anyway, there's uh basically I'm um, like the reason I AFK a lot on this world is because um to make like a bunch of like power and to get a bunch of resources from that sludge refiner. We also found out the limit for the uh buffer no the uh he to rf converter which is 2000 gigariffs yeah that right there is the biggest mistake i'll probably make in the whole entire series so far <laughs> throwing freaking gold in a freaking thermal uh tinker's construct uh smeltery 
Because you best believe that the stuff didn't just make gold blocks. No sorry, it made freaking electrium. I don't need electrium. Good heavens. Alright, so now I'm going to put... I'm going to move the uh, base and the, cra the uh, casting table into the other side, and we're going to have two basins on the same side. After I ch chuck most of my junk in the inventory... Oh, yes. Bunch of coal. So with all that coal that we have in our inventory right now, we're actually going to throw that in the smelter and smelt it down and make graphite out of it. All right, now I'm going to switch the uh, tables around. All the, all the tables are turning. <laughs> Got the casting table on the right side of the uh, smeltery. And this is the part where I realized I fucked up. <laughs> and I successfully start cursing. Yeah. I do that anyway, don't I? <laughs> oh, good heavens. Ninety-five percent of my videos is just me walking back and forth. God. All right, so we're trying to find all the pulverized gold that we we're trying to find any gold that we have. That's really weird that the only thing that's wrong with the recording is the microphone itself. Like, the chest opening is perfectly fine. But, my audio is not. So I'll have to figure out why that is in the recording software. I could probably actually do that right now, but I do have to, like, voice over this. I can't, like, multitask that much. All right, we're going to get to our electrum here. Yeah, what a pro gamer move that was. Me trying to figure out a way to make gold. <laughs> it didn't work out so well. Yeah, you get methane and 64 gold uh, ingots from a uh, 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 notch apple. Oh, good heavens. Oh. I think I should start having like a little counter that like every time I say good heavens, it's just like ding adds another good heavens tick. Me desperately trying to find any sort of way to make a freaking any way to make gold. <laughs> nice. Me casually accepting that I now have Electrium. What the heck did I do? Graphite. And now we're looking for uh, probably more gold again. So the reason we're looking for gold in the first place is because we have to make the uh, the legend the uh, reactor core thing. Yeah, that's what we're making. Reactor. Yeah, I don't even know how to spell sometimes. <laughs> or. Okay, first we're making the reactor power tap. And now I'm going to be spending the next five minutes looking for iron because I thought I had some in my chests, but I don't. Uh... 
Oh, I think I know what went wrong here. I had it set for Oz, Ozio. Focus right USB Oz, Ozio. And that's probably what fucked up the recording, because I don't know why exactly, but it probably did. Anyway. So we're going to grab a bunch of redstone now. This is a lot harder to do when you're like, you're just sitting here doing nothing. I hate doing nothing. ADHD be like. All right, we're going to grab some more of this. Uh, yeah, we're going to just chuck the redstone in there. That seems like such a great idea. Red idea. Uh, we already the liquid iron has such a lovely color. I have like a bunch of alloys in here. It's like crazy. All right, still waiting for the iron to sol solidify. All right, I'm trying to make, we're going to just throw that in there. Start smelting our gold grit. Um, not grit, but powder. Yes. <laughs> Are you making a joke about a popular meme right now? I throw in 20 blocks of gold. I receive six blocks of electrium. I think it was actually only four, but yeah. That Minecraft music hitting different though, I swear. All right, so now we're going to start smelting the uranium because we're going to need that for the... Uh, Reactor. Now this is the part where I'd be stupid and like put it in my inventory. Basically, now I'm talking about uh, how much radiation each ingot of uranium has. So that's exciting. So we're making the reactor core casing core. Yes. Making the reactor casing now. I, I I certainly did not make enough for any size reactor. I know I will now figure out how to make a comparator. Nope, oh, I haven't got to that. <laughs> I'm spoiling it for myself. That was there. Okay, right, so now we got the power port thing. Now we're gonna re-radium. Alright, and we're gonna make a comparator for it. Is that what it calls for? Going in here, get some quartz. Gonna get some redstone. Oh, nope. I'm looking for stone right now, guaranteed. Yep, and I don't have any stones, so I'm gonna go ahead and throw some into the smelter. Hey, look, I literally just said that. <laughs> yeah, anyway, let's get lethal doses of radiation because I'm such a smart man. Just decide to get to not get a hazmat suit. Oh, radiation. What's the worst I could do? Kill me? <laughs> So what we're going to do now is we're going to make this into a tinker's table. Crafting station, that's what it is. A chest that has no purpose unless I have like 600 uh, ores. <laughs> 
All right, now we're going to make our uh, redstone torches. I am not even smart enough to make redstone torches, apparently. Wow. <laughs> this man really... Man. All right. Now we finally got a comparator. So now we're going to have to look for more iron. The hunt always continues. We got forward iron in there, and we're going to grab our red, the radioactive stuff again. Forgot the damn diamond. <laughs> look at that. We're running around like a headless chicken. Oh my god, I get a diaper radiation. All right. Look at that. Gonna make our. Uh, we're not gonna make any of the reactor glass yet. Why? Gotta get more cancer. <laughs> All right. So now we're gonna grab some wood and we're gonna make our lovely uh, piston. I wonder what kind of cancer you get from holding, like, uranium in your hand. <laughs> or, like, any other kind of, like, lethal, uh, like, radioactive element. Probably bone cancer, certainly. Like, leukemia or something. I don't know if that's the same thing or not. I'm not a... I am not very educated when it comes to, uh, that kind of stuff. Alright, now... We're going to make our pistons. Make like six control rods. I think I only made four. And now we have to get four more uranium ingots. All right, now we're gonna make our uh, fuel rods, and I will probably grab the whole. Uh, nope, I'm not gonna grab the whole entire stack. Make four. Uh, so make eighteen of those. Uh, Sixteen of those. Yeah, okay, yep. Now I'm gonna die. All right. We get nine out of that, and we're going to go ahead and get some more iron so we can make the other nine. And I'm coming over here to see if we have any iron. Of course we don't, so now we got to use our... Now we finally have our iron again. I forgot I edited that part out again. <laughs> Just enough. Look at that. Yeah, okay. Now we're going to have to make this a two-parter because I did not have enough resources for this. And I have no idea what I went in there for. So, there's that as well. Actually, I should just make a uh, another channel just critiquing my videos on my first channel. <laughs> That'd be funny. And now we're going to attempt to put a big reactor in a small space. Because that totally makes a lot of sense. You won't believe how well this works out. Oh yeah, let's just throw the pickaxe too. That's a great idea. I totally didn't need that for anything. All right. Now, there's probably not going to be an outro for this because uh, my audio... Not, I mean, not because of that, but... I don't think I recorded it properly. <laughs> Wowee, I need a control rod for this. I can't believe how, like, angry I am. I, angry I sound because I have to use a control rod for this. And then I placed down a fuel rod, like, that's really going to help. <laughs> when it clearly says a control rod. There we go, I finally grew a brain cell, look at that. Hell yeah. 
machine is too small. My visual disappointment when they said the machine is too small. What do you mean I can't make it three blocks small? That's ridiculous. <laughs> There's so many holes in my floor, it's not even funny. Oh, I snap like a Rice Krispie Treats. So now I'm going to have to make more of the uh, reactor uh, con the, the reactor uh, core. Structure core. I don't know what it's really called. All right, now we're going to go ahead and go down to the basement. And we're just going to go ahead and set up shop there. Yeah, ain't any gold anywhere in here. I don't imagine that. That's still not connected. <laughs> I'm still waiting for mushrooms to grow in here. I'm kind of disappointed. I wonder if we could make lawyer mushrooms in there. That'd be interesting. Let's fill that up. All right, place down a reactor. All right, yeah, we're just going to put up. Oh, wow, look at that. I can't even place a block properly. All right, you're going to have the reactor uh, control, uh, flux power tap on the side. Then we're going to have a cable running through the ground, probably around, like this way. Let's run under there, and it's going to go right into there. It should, yes. I have trapped myself. Congratulations. The exit door is now open. <laughs> That's that. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe if you guys haven't already. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. Goodbye. Dang it. Okay. <laughs> Alright, hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys next time.